हेलो फ्रेंड्स सो आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन अबाउट अरोबिक डे नाइट एच डी एम एल लाइब्रेरी मैनेजर अ कन्फिग्रेशन फॉर क्लाइंट लिप्स सो आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन ईच एंड एवरी ऑप्शन रिलेटेड टू दिस कन्फिग्रेशन सो आई विल स्टार्ट फ्रॉम मिनी फाइव आई एम गोइंग टू द कन्फिग्रेशन एंड क्लिकिंग ऑन मिनी फाइव सो वॉट मिनी फाइज डज मिनी फाइव रिमूव ऑल द एक्स्ट्रा स्पेसिस फ्रॉम द नेटवर्क कॉल्स आई जस्ट नीड टू रिस्टार्ट माई बंडल रिलेटेड टू दिस क्लाइंट लाइब्रेरी and clearing the cache because uh, uh, because the data may get served from the cache so i don't want this option so i loading the page and we can see that all the css files are having a selector called min in their network calls and uh, while seeing the preview and response we can see that th these are minification version of our css same goes for js there is a there are all the files with the selector min and these are minified version so these helps me to you know, load the page faster and uh, the size of the network calls become decreased so this is very important in that case and now moving to another configuration named it debug so debug is like adding quote debug client lips is equal to true so let's have a quick demo of this as well save it restart the bundle and going over here and i have just created a dummy test component and in this i am adding a client lips 2 client lips 2 is embedding a client lips 1 so what embed does embed just uh, you know uh, add add the embedded client lips in it so what uh, i need I, i want to show just going to client lips and go to client lips 2 so i'm just embedding client lips one in it so while clearing the cache and again reloading the page what i can see is what and i can see okay let let the page reload Okay. Let me see what. Okay, client lib is getting loaded, and now if I see, I can click over here and I can see test dot js. The client lib seven is not getting embedded into it. Why? So because I have added debug is equal to true, and I can also see that client lib two is embedding client lib one under it. I can see it over here. So there is a network call for every client lib library because this helps in debugging. This is very important from the debugging perspective. Same goes for CSS file. When I go over here, I can see that okay, client lib two is embedding client lib one as well, but the uh, test dot CSS has only the context of itself. So it it is very helpful in debugging and it is mostly used for the dev environments. So let's move to the third configuration. which is gzip and this is also very very interesting let me uncheck all of these things this is not mandatory i'm just doing it okay let's save it again restart the bundle okay i'm just removing this client lib because they will get loaded again again and again again clearing the cache Okay. Yes, yes. Reload the page. Just all these things from here. Okay. Now I can see that every every network call is having content encoding gzip in the response header. and in the request header there is accept encoding gzip this means that browser is requesting for a gzip version of the network call and server is providing a gzip version so this creates a compressed version of every js or css files this is also very important from the prod environment because during the evaluation in the figures you can see that there is a lot of difference in the sizes and the time uh, of uh, these two before and after gzip figures so gzip and minification 
uh, you know uh, removes a lot of overhead from the page loading and uh, these uh, two things helps me to load page faster and the request is having an ideal way of uh, you know uh, gzip implementation when response header is having content encoding as gzip and request has a header is ha having accept encoding as gzip so these three options are very important so that's all thank you